Hey guys, I never really do anything like this, but this is a different video, something I've never done before. Uh, we were at the cabaret, some crazy shit happened. Um, not really the craziest shit, but definitely something different than the norm at the comedy cabaret Wednesday nights. It all started when a comedian got to the comedy cabaret claiming that he just got out of his father's funeral. Um, talking to the other comedians outside dressed up in black um, and immediately everyone's heart went out for the guy we all felt bad for him you know uh, he was very convincing he also held a memorial card of, uh, of a person that recently died and um, which he claimed was his dad and we later found out well watch the video the first part of the video will show Brian Lecter um, helping this guy out. Uh, he opened his heart to him, felt bad for him. The guy's dad just died, apparently. Um, and uh, we, all, we all actually opened up our hearts to him, kind of felt bad for him. Something struck me, and I thought to myself, I said, this guy could be a character. And once I brought that up, uh, Rick Rebotin immediately remembered another comic from South Jersey telling him about a uh, comic who just got out of a funeral, a brother's funeral, and played that character all night long. Uh, it seemed as though this was too coincidental, so uh, Rick did his fact checking, and uh, we found out this guy was the, in fact, scammer. Um, the part that I don't get, like, I understand it's a bit character, you know, you want to commit to your character, by all means, do so. Um, the part that I don't get, though, is why you would ask other comedians for like sympathy you ask them for help with jokes saying it's your first time ever and even the bartender I mean even at the end of this video you'll see Donna the bartender poor Donna she also opened up her heart for him um, and she was pissed off at the end when she found out it was all just a big joke um, you'll see Brian Lichter giving him some advice trying to help him out and then it'll cut to that guy's actual performance on stage and after that you'll see him and Matt Reese um, right by the bar at the Comedy Cabaret so enjoy writing I've read a, written a lot so like I feel like there's something I could give you can you write me anything like now right now yeah, or like, um, it doesn't have to be good man don't worry about like what you would write oh, for well, yourself like, <laughs> like even right. a joke you heard growing up or something or anything okay. to remember man I have like enough to do I don't know like a minute and a half right now Josh if you just like talk between the jokes I mean I don't know how you're gonna be but if you talk between the jokes and say like you know, hey, this is my first time. I hope I don't screw it up. But the if other I guy suck, told me not to do that. Who said that? <laughs> I don't know. It was the guy who got long, he's got Back to Future t shirt. Yeah, you know who that is? Noah Hulahan. No, who? Noah Hulahan. I don't yeah, he's got like okay. So he told you not to watch. He said, don't. I don't even fucking remember. Uh, don't. No. Ap don't apologize. Don't say. Oh I'm no! I don't mean apologize. It's more like, look, if I suck, you didn't pay me to do this shit. Something like that. <laughs> you didn't pay me. Are you filming this? Yeah. Oh, sorry. Can I should I break the third, can I fourth say wall. That? Third. What? Can I say? Of course, dude. I mean, it's your first time, you know? If you have, like, your style is whatever it is, and I don't know what your style is, because obviously I haven't did everything, man. He did one-liners, he did all just... He was kind of dirty. Oh, your so, dad was a comic? For a little bit. Not okay. for a, it was yeah. a pro or anything. He did like, shit with mics like this. No, no offense. Yeah, I, I do little, not know. But so. you, you did dirty stuff. It doesn't have to be clean or anything. Would your dad want you to use any of his old jokes? I know like, this. You know, to get you I don't remember shit about his jokes. All right, I was you know what? When he did it, I, I'll give you. Um, just keep, you, keep, keep giving jokes, man. Uh, this is a joke that I do sometimes, and uh, it works Plug about seventy-five percent of the time. And uh, like, don't hold on to it, but you can do it tonight. Um, it's, it's, 
I don't know like how dirty you go. What about, a heart on this guy, man. It's about, you didn't pay me. It's about pedophilia. All right. Okay? I don't care, man. And it just goes. It's <laughs> fucking dirty, man. I'll do it's it. It's dirty. Now. Of course it's dirty. That's why pedophilia. I mean, it's hard to write a clean joke about pedophilia. But, I'll you know, do it. Yeah. You could try it out, you know, I'm not saying it's gonna work, but it's, it's first time. You're my fucking closer now. It, you know what? It doesn't matter. It doesn't, first open mic ever. It doesn't matter if it's good, it matters that you do it. My uh, first open mic, I mean, it was fucking great, but you shouldn't it. expect that. You didn't find this place. How'd you find this place? Fucking internet. I went on, yeah. opened, I googled on my fucking phone, mm -hmm. in the fucking bathroom. Oh. Yeah. Over at Lakeview, I fucking... Lakeview? Where's yeah. that? Uh, fucking over... You guys from Jersey? Anybody? Mm -hmm. No? That's where my... It's like a... They do... Like, it's a I know center. some comedians over in Jersey, like... ...and other dudes like that. You know, probably, you know, I didn't you know, know he was from Jersey. Jersey. No. Yeah, he's from Jersey. Oh, wow. He's all, I always see him at Pug, so I thought he was like in Doylestown or something. He does, a lot, he does all the mics over there. He does all the mics over there. So, are you saying you Googled this like today? And open just like came mic, over? Open mic Philadelphia. And there's a chart with like every day of the week. Mm -hmm. And there was like four places. But this is like a real. All the other ones just said open mic, like music and shit like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. And this one had comedy in the name of the place. It's all comedy. So just don't. So what? What number are you going up? Uh, did you sign up? Yeah, I just read them. Okay. You get a lot of jokes so far. Like five. Five. Can so, I? How long do you have to? Uh, about uh, five. Like, five minutes. So if I do a minute for each one, plus I gotta say a piece to look in the beginning. You don't have to do, and you just have to not do too much time. If you can only do them, I mean, I would try and go for the full time until they like you. But you know, if you can't, don't matter. Do three minutes if that's all you got. Uh, and and uh, and uh, it's real. Um, shit, I've totally lost track of what I was saying. Um, yeah, so just do it. And also, it right now, it's kind of hard. Be lying. That's right. That's right. I like that. That he's. My, you're my Yo, name. Name. Nick. Oh, that's right. What's your last name, dude? All right. So, uh, if he screws up your name, maybe he could be like, "Hey, that's a bad name, name to screw up." I just up. Nick. I just because people always fuck my name. Okay. So yeah, start with that. Hey, I just wrote Nick. I was fucking. You know what? It's hard to take advice though, because everybody's like, everybody's an amateur that thinks they know what they're saying, but everybody's got a different style. I don't know what your style is. I don't either. Are you I more of like a... It, pretty much. Are you an energetic guy? Are you like... Uh, I mean, dude, you've got a bit right there, man. You look like you're dressed for a bit. I just like you're ready for it. I, well, I mean, then they don't know that. Yeah, huh. I do. I told everybody. Uh, I mean, like, an audience. Uh, is there people? No. More? There's a couple people that don't know. I got that walked in after. Do you got anything else to say? Any last words? Is that like a joke or last words? No, like, uh, you know, before you fucking go up there. Oh, and for me. Eat the. Yeah, you. Mm. Yeah, you. I mean, I don't know. You got anything? Awkward. You need any more jokes? I don't know. No. I'm trying to wrap it up here, but it's, I mean, I'm not good. I'm not a good host. Sorry. That's fine. You, dude, you help me. Did I help you? I got more shit to say. All right. That's all I can. That's all I'm at. Cool. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Of course. You get ready to watch me eat shit up there. Dude, I love seeing people do their first time because it's not about how you do. It's just about fucking doing it. I don't know. That's how I feel. That's about what everyone's. It. That's the one thing that everyone has said. That's not whether you're funny or good or. Bad. It's like just being, just doing it. Yeah, dude. There's plenty of people that think they're funny that haven't even done one open mic. Fuck them. Yeah, and if, plus if your dad, you know, if your dad has performed, then you probably have it like in your family, you know. Uh -huh.
What? I don't know if I believe that, man. Okay. I'm mean, like, I get it. I'm already like, my fucking hand's starting to shake. Dude, shit. that does, of course, this is your first open mic. You think, like, I don't think, I think it's few and far between of people who are just, like, totally confident the first time. Like, don't expect that. You expect a way too much of a thing. I don't know, man. Just fucking kill it. Slay it. Kill it. You can probably give me the best advice, man. Alright, cool. I don't know what advice I gave you, but you just fucking go out there. It made me feel the best, like I'm not gonna take half of shit out there. Well, I think I hate you. Is my heart beating fast? I just gotta let you know real quick who this before my time starts. <laughs> Uh, my fucking dad died, and I'm doing this for him. I, I'm not fucking funny or anything like you guys are. And, uh, <laughs> what were you it's my, so this one's for my dad, Vincent, and uh, yeah. uh, he was a comic for a little while. I always love him, you know. So, so this one's for you, Dad. But, uh, speaking of fucking retards. <laughs> I used to work overnight at a uh, supermarket, you know, and I used to stock the shelves with a bunch, of, a whole bunch of retards. I was the only normal person on the crew, right? Which you think would be fucking awesome, right? You'd be the king of the tards, you know? But it turns out that they all make fun of you, you know? Like, uh, you got David with the Downs and, and Mongoloid Mark would do impressions of me, you know what I mean? They'd be like, uh, hey, hey, Mark, did you, did you hear Nick the other day? He was like, hey guys, how are you? Yeah. <laughs> uh, by the way, my dad's not dead. You know? It's a fucking bit. You know? yeah. I know someone knew. Someone said Chris Wood's fucking name, the guy with the pants and the pots. Yeah, yeah, we I'm knew it sure all along, I'm sure he spilled the beans. Yeah, but we there, all know it. Yeah, well, there's a guy who gets his rocks off by bashing pots and pans, so he's got to spill the beans. That's the best thing he did all night. Yeah, so, uh, oh, yeah? Hey, 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 the t-shirts oh, yeah? were cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks, bro. Yeah, but anyway, back to fucking retards. I'm not that retard. I'm talking about, hey, let's get some pulled over for like eating a Dorito. Here's a funny joke about getting pulled over, right? I got pulled over on the way over here, right? It's uh, 65 miles a fucking hour, so it's double the fine, right? But I, I fucking was way lucky, you know? This is true life, by the way. I don't need to fucking... It's not Doritos or anything. The guy... Fucking uh, relax. Uh, yeah. Hey, That's cool, cool enough. But anyway, the fucking guy, he fucking, uh, you know, he says, uh, I'm going to let you off with a verbal warning, all right? The cop was kind of cool. I'm not from Philly. I thought Philly cops were fucking dicks. But he's like, listen, you know, don't speed anymore, butt fucker. You know what I mean? <laughs> Oh man, now we start a thing right here. Can we just like, uh, get, no, yeah, keep coming. Like, give me some shit to go off of. We already did go over to it. I was fooled. Ah, you weren't fooled at all, man. Fuck you. Oh, this guy's Fuck the you. smartest Fuck guy. You. Fuck you. You <laughs> lied to me, all oh. friends. Dude. You guys all hate me now? Yeah, yeah. you're an asshole. Everybody? Even that dude that was way nice to me, like, Yo, fuck get out of here. Out of here. Yo, no, 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 Piece of shit! Piece of shit! Go fuck yourself! This is what he wants, dude! Let's all just fucking walk out! Fuck this guy! Hey, man! It's all good humor! Alright, I'll go away! Hey, hey, you guys have been fucking great! Thanks for the time, man! Woo! Yeah, uh, this is the professional establishment. We try to keep it professional here. You know, comedians, we all got egos. Tiger out the cage, dude. That's all it is. It's all good. Well, it's very comfortable in here. Um, but that's what happens sometimes. We're going to get this show moving. What a very unfortunate guy's about to come up after this <laughs> uncomfortable, almost a fight. Comedians upset. It's, it, it happens. That fuck just punked us and stole our shitty jokes. Can you last year? Can you? And the fight continues outside.
Describe you, your height, your glasses, uh, right. your hair, your your beard, your suit. It's cool, so you blew the top off the whole thing, right? No, my boy Rick did. I give him all the credit in the world, bro. This guy's filming. This is like yeah. this you gotta say, man, it's, it's gonna be good videos, dude. That's I happening know, tonight. I'm cool with it, dude. I'm cool with it. I don't mean but I'm not gonna get bashed on stage, man. I'm gonna stand up for myself. Right I respect that, man. That's cool, man. And and uh, hey, man, that's a good bit, man. But you're gonna piss a lot of people off the one, bro. No, I mean, I, I, I used to go up on stage and be like, let's hear it for what's his name about the host, and they all got pissed at me, so uh, I've got to learn like, what to do and what not to do. Man. Hey, man, well, I appreciate Keep not doing to it, bro. my face or nothing. I don't fight, man. That's just yeah, stupid. And, 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 and I'll go to jail. Like, I it's on video. For sure, because you knew. I'm sorry, I'm going to be But, uh... You saw it. They just shat on me for trying to shit on them. It's an open mic. So mind, don't so. come to the comedy cabaret unless you want to get shit on. <laughs> yeah? And that's the truth, man. Don't lie about death. But the card you had, man. You made that yourself, then? I mean, he said he saw a card. So we uh, we almost believed you again. No, you should have believed. The I, card I mean, again. I really yeah. thought you were going to go up on stage and blow my shit up, which you should have done. I thought well, we didn't know until you said that. For yeah, real, yeah, I because... thought you were going to blow my shit up. Oh, we did, I thought man. someone was going to. I thought maybe you were going to. Nah, I knew it was a character, so I wanted to let uh, you ride yeah, it yeah. out. Dude, I didn't mean to blow your spot up, man. No, but it, cool, it just man. Went, it hit me the wrong way. When, uh, hey, yeah. man. We, no, I started first, though, because I said, we knew. Yeah, that was me. It, that was yeah, me. I admit and then that. Went, like, I would have shot up. I don't have any. I don't even barely know the guy. How long have you been really doing comedy? Uh, like three or four open mics. Oh, okay. right? So I'm new to it. Oh, right. This is just something I thought would be funny, yeah. you know, but uh, it turns out it pissed everybody off. Well, you know? I mean. These guys are like uh, a band of brothers, man. You don't want to fuck with any yeah. of them. Well, I mean, it's like. It's like I mean, I don't know what to say, man, because it was just weird. Yeah, you know, yeah, like it's supposed to be. nobody does that. Yeah, I know. I, I did. Yeah, yeah. yeah, that's like a dude who came in a wheelchair once here. Yeah. He got up on the stage in a wheelchair, and at the end of his bit, hopped out of that shit. See, I don't. I didn't. No one. Called, no one. No one knew what to say. I was young, man. man this is like my house. Did you bro. hate it or you liked it? Everybody hated it, man. Really? People so told your dad really that. didn't die. Nah, no, nah, no, nah. No, I'm you sorry. You told me that your dad died. I'm sorry died. if I offended you. It's part of my bit. It's a character. <laughs> Character in the room. Good luck, man. Oh, yeah. To the bartender. Oh, I'm, well, I gotta build, make it believable. So, hey, man, I appreciate you filming all this. I'm um, wrapping it up. He's running out of juice. I'm a total asshole. Catch us live on YouTube. Or not really live. Catch it whenever the fuck this guy loads it up to YouTube. He's not gonna email me the link because he doesn't have my email. All right, he's shaking his head. Yeah, maybe I'll give him my email. Maybe not. Find out next time when I do this exact same bit next week. To the same fucking people. That's it. It is what it is. It was what it was. Back to the humor. <laughs> <laughs>